What's good, my brother? What's going hey, there, on? Yo, man, we back at it, man. Real individual podcast, R.I.P. Um, bro, I'm just going to jump straight in, man. Quavo and Takeoff, they on a the run, man. I seen them on the Champs. That was a raw interview, though. The boys still doing their thing, man. Always finding a way to push through. I'm confused. And then Nori asked him, though, said, uh, yo, would y'all do a verse? He's like, yeah. But he was, then um, Nori was like, well, we got to have all three members of the Migos. How you think? Whatever, whatever. Basically asking them, could that be? If the money right, if the money right, you gonna hey, we gonna reunite or whatever. I wonder who they'll go against though. They said no OGs, so it gotta be I guess a newer generation type of someone within their I'm same hearing, generation. I'm hearing, I'm hearing Ray Shrum, and I feel like that'd be fair. Even though Migos got way more music, Ray Shrum got big hits though, and it's only twenty. So you know what I mean? It, so it'll I be a, it'll be a good I battle. Think, I'm thinking so too. Yeah, man. Another drink champ interview. I don't know. Is I, I don't even know if it's still out. Kanye had an interview. Oh, Guess it was so time. bad. Nori had to apologize. So yeah, that, it was over, man. The interview just never happened. Yeah. You know. I, I that's why I heard it and watched it. I said, let me watch this because I know they're gonna take this. You knew, you knew it was coming. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I already knew. People re-uploading it, but it's just a matter of time so they clip those channels as we well. Tell those so. getting out too, yo. Yo, any, what are you talking about, though? You said building a city, though? Yeah, it's, Yaco system. I'm thinking about moving the Yaco system. Been in Florida my whole life, man. I think it's time for a change. Yaco system, $20 Yeezys, $5 T-shirts. It's, just, it's crazy, man. I is think, that what he uh, said? I know he said he wanted to... Um, lower the prices to his product so i could just imagine i'm just thinking of just some stuff how it'd be the the yeezys would be 80 percent off everything could just be cheap you had to go to don you have to roll in donda that's the only way to live in the city so it's like <laughs> he's really building he's building that you know what he's building a you know what bro i don't know if that's happening but you never know with kanye he's just thinking of random stuff so we'll no, I, think he, I think he's just talking right now yeah, yeah, yeah. It is what it is, you know? Mm -hmm. Yo, God bless. Bless him, man. Bless everybody, bro. <laughs> That's it, man. But mm -hmm. on some positive, on some positive stuff, man, it's a lot of growth going on in, in, in the in the uh, music business. Diddy been growing, but I come to find out more recently he had three um three preparatory schools and he actually visited one recently in the Bronx. Like, wow, man, like you know what I mean? Like the, one of the most entertaining entertainers <laughs> in our time, and this is what he's doing now. Yeah, <laughs> that's Diddy, man. Oh man, pulling up to the schools doing the Diddy dance, but that's good though, man. Schooling is one of the ways I see a lot of people are getting into, man, and they trying to really build it from the ground up. That's where you really get to the people. You got to get to them in the school. So for him to take that route. Shout out to Diddy, man. No, nah, shout out to Diddy, seriously. Man. Mm hmm Man, you going to that Pharrell three-day conference in Virginia, that business forum uh, conference? man? Nah, I won't be able to make it, man. It's a three-day thing, so I, I won't be able to book that many days out. Yeah. Always got to grind, man. Let's get to that money. 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 Hey, have you, you, have you heard that? Uh, it's like a one of them internet songs, TikTok oh, real, or whatever. I haven't heard that one. Real, that, that's the new one. That's the newer no, station. Oh no, nah, homie, homie, buzzing dog. They showed them at some school, and um, and it wasn't. You know how you can tell when people put it together? No, he went during a pep rally, and they uh, went crazy. They get yeah. that much. like you. Nah, no, that no, no, stage no. and that, and it was a regular. Like it's like a, it was a dude with a nice camera, but it wasn't no. He, like a setup, like, you know what I'm talking about? Like it mm -hmm. wasn't no music video. This performance at that pep rally. No, no, that's clever. You get all the people in one one area. That's where you're supposed to go. Also, at one point, they they couldn't take it no more. They came out of the bleachers and got in with them. Yeah, but this is the part I said they was clever as hell. He had a drone there too, though. So during that part when it was all huddled around him, it was like an aerial part, just oh. like a few seconds. Yeah, 
Then no, he ran out of that, that, and then the cameraman found him again. It was raw. I can't describe it. I was like, this is the craziest reel I ever see. Well, Joe Dudes is getting know. innovative, man. He, hey, I don't even, I can't even shout him out, man, because I don't I'm know a, his rep, man. I got to find I got to try to find him. GTTM. Get to that money. Y'all check it out. GTTM. Get to that money. Just, child, I don't even care, man. man. Like, no, I, no, I'm man. showing love right now. That's, that, that, that's, that's respect. all. Because the it's dude catchy. That, man. It's catchy, man. Like it's definitely for the for the for the youngest man. It's catchy though. Get to that money. Let's get to that money. Then he got his own little dance with it. Like it's crazy. Bro. Oh yeah, yeah. Like, no, nah, salute, salute to the young man, man. Keep grinding, great marketing. And it's one of the dances everybody can do, bro. You mm. might not look as cool as him doing it. Yeah. But it's not nothing. It's not a whole routine. Yeah, it's, yeah, no, yeah. no, no, no. It's, it's 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 a simple little step. But it's the way you do it and your swag and you do extra little hand movements if you want. Like it, it's crazy. It's like optional. He got something. You could you know when you know when it's there. So that was the beginning. So he gonna... I caught myself in the mirror. I I'm downloading that song and gets it that money. I, <laughs> I, I need I need I need a theme song. That might be my theme song for the for the rest of who, the, yeah. who don't want to get to the money though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you when you get saying catchy, that's what I tell you uh, a couple episodes ago. TikTok, man, the TikTok dance. Hey, man. Things. Hey, say less. Oh, say less, bro. Uh, send me a beat. I'm coming out of retirement. I'm not even playing. Yeah. It's, it's strictly about hits right now, though. I'm <laughs> telling you, bro, like, it don't even matter. Even if it's a 30 second clip, what a full song at, though. This is strictly I, TikTok. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so no, nah, I got you, though, man. But speaking of music, though, man. A new collab album, an unexpected collab album. What's that? Twenty One Savage and Drake, October twenty eighth. So that, Spooky that was, hours. yeah. So that's a good birthday gift, man. Y'all dropping on my birthday. Appreciate the birthday gift, y'all, man. October twenty eighth, man. Slaughter gang, OVO coming through. The door. <laughs> it's a six o eight from the to Toronto. <laughs> it's a whole the corner playing with the vision mode. Yeah, he said my man said man's them said <laughs> new 21 flow coming soon, bro. Oh man. Oh just decided it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be interesting. Cause 21 always find a way to I can't describe it. But even before I knew what that was, I never heard rap like that. Maybe you, you was the closest thing. But if y'all heard Kluke's rapping back in the day, it's seriously. So, bro, I was only that difference one, is, man. only difference is clues on the outside, so people had it was like whatever. Yeah. But, yeah. Hey, listen to this. Listen to this. Slaughter gang, whatever, no, no, bro. What you say, bro? This shit hard. Slaughter gang, rapper, man. <laughs> no, but I never for real. I never heard rapper like that. Every but he didn't even have the A B scheme. He didn't have the A A B whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, he had, yeah. Like sometimes, sometimes he didn't rhyme for like two, three bars, but like <laughs> he had, he had a, a good little style that, that caught on, bro. He really he and kept he up with it. You know, always sounded sleepy. Mm. Actually, I take that back. One person did it before. I really no disrespect. I just ain't I listen to him like that. But trade the truth. Yeah, he, yeah, that old, that old, and I don't mean boring because it's not entertaining, but I'm trying to describe it. That yeah. old boring, uh, uh, monotone, like Mod that. yeah, it's really, yeah, the monotone. This is what it is, but it still sounds good, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, he, he was one of the first. So, everybody got some new drop. Matter of fact, Rihanna dropping a new sports wear line, Athleisure, so the ladies could look good, run their errands, and still be comfortable. I mean, it's kind of cold, depending on where you live at, but down south, it don't matter. Yeah, as long as you just make it inside the gym, you know, have your jackets and sweaters on, then you can rock that new Rihanna fitness line, man. So, Lululemon, watch out. Rihanna's coming. Oh, yeah. No, they done. I hope it's traded publicly. I'm in on that, but I don't, I, I believe yeah. whatever she put out is going to sell. I believe. I'm trying to get in on that. Is that traded publicly? Hmm. I don't know. I wonder if the fancy, the fancy beauty line she got, because that's like a billion dollar company. So I wonder if that's public. I don't know if it's private, but keep a lookout on that. Whatever Rihanna's business thing is, her name, I'm yeah. look yeah. into that, because uh, the next bull market, Rihanna might as well just contemplate releasing a public uh, company. 
Yep. Oh, it's coming, bro. Um, of the bull, the next bull market, bro. I say for the new year. Yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll retire from the stock market. Just building up, build your cash flow, and do your research. Bro. Oh no, that's all I'm doing now. I'm not. I'm not investing, investing, but I'm putting my money in there. If that makes sense. I'm putting my money in more safe, secure uh, <laughs> assets. Yeah, that's the way to go, bro. Yeah, because yeah. right. I, I just, I have to stop the bleeding, bro. <laughs> I just been buying, just lowering my average cost. That's what I've been doing the last two to three weeks. <laughs> I was just lowering. You think about it, I'm down 70, 60 percent in all my plays. So why not try to lower yeah. that cost? It's going to possibly not financial advice. This is from me to you, but look out for uh, a Christmas rally. A Christmas. Uh, oh, one last, yeah, yeah, yeah. One last for the fourth quarter. And then it's going to And then 2020. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Speaking on all these celebrities, they have a College Hill celebrity edition season two, bro. Um, Ray J, Amber Rose. Iman Shrumper, Jocelyn, a couple more people going to be on there. So, sound like it should be good. You think they're getting real degrees? That's what I'm saying. Like, what is this? Because College Hill usually has stuff to do with college students. Now, they, you just call it Celebrity Hill. Why is this called it Celebrity whatever? I think they're really going to college, but I'm saying, is this TD college? That's what or I'm saying. Gonna... Yeah, this is like, what degree happens after, what, season one? Or you got to go to four seasons to get a bachelor's? Right. How you get a degree in one season? And the like, season's only, be, listen, the season's only be like two weeks. <laughs> So no, nah, yeah. Nah, sometimes it's like a month or whatever, but still, they don't be there that long. It just seemed like that because of all that camera time. Yeah, and then they release them once a week, but they might have did all the filming in two months, but we get it in three to six months, and once a week for like a couple couple months. So yeah, I don't know. That it's it's a good business play, but I don't think that 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 degree ain't gonna mean nothing in the world. Yo, yo, I graduated college too. Can I go to whatever like? Uh, yeah, I mean, nah, but speaking of um, speaking of bad blood, I don't even think we're speaking of bad blood. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it's all good. It's the girl. Hey, no, nah. hey, I don't know what happened, but Jay Z want to part ways with Duce. He's trying to sell his because he had a 50 50 partnership, so he's trying to sell his half to Bacardi. But Bacardi's not offering him a fair um, share, according to him. Yeah. And even his lawyers advised him of this. Because Jay-Z ain't no regular. You can't come at Jay-Z with no. Mm -hmm. I'll give you a hundred yeah, million. Yeah, that ain't, that ain't going to work. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. That no, ain't boss, boss, how much you want? How much you going to get? Five grand. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Damn, y'all, bro. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. All jokes aside, the average person, they hear a hundred million. It's over, bro. Even like 10 million, it's over. Yeah, yeah. So, Shout out to Jay-Z for not selling the show short. No, nah, get as much as you can. But speaking of business, though, Mal is accusing Joe of bad business. You took money from me and Rory. Give us our money back. We want to see the accounting. We want to see the taxes. Yeah, he <laughs> said he'll sit down. I, I saw some of that interview. He said he'll sit down with um, – yeah. he'll come on that show and sit down with him. If you pull out the books, pull out all the paperwork. I'm like, oh, he really mean this. Yeah. Somebody's lying here. He was means this. Yeah, that's somebody's that's, lying, or that was a gross misunderstanding. Yeah, and two things could be true. So, Joe responded. He said he provided them stuff before prior. So this is gonna be a back and forth. I don't want to say a petty back and forth because they was real homies, but I don't think that whole situation really. It's not over yet. It's a lot of stuff, a lot of feelings being held. So. Even if it's over in the public, that, that conversation not over. That that got to be had, hashed out. Joe Button, we'll we'll join your podcast network. How much? Hey man, tell you, bro. Boots, just do it for the look, man. Look, <laughs> you stay in my basement. Stay in my basement, and I need you to record anytime I tell you. To. <laughs> yeah, bro. <real. laughs> got a free place to live, dog. That's it. Now, I, I would do that for a year. Like, now nah, I don't know. That's a long time, though, to get for nah, sometimes, sometimes people play interns, though. I think I'd intern yeah. if I had to. If I had a place to stay and, my, and I could take care of my bare necessities, like getting something to eat. So I got to eat, bro. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Leave it 
just starving. Like, yeah, starving in the basement. Oh, like, yeah, you got a studio session, got all type. Now you gotta wait till, till you want that. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I agree. It's the opportunity that matters, dog. Gotta keep grinding, man. Speaking of opportunity and grinding, shout out to Damian Lillard, man. Um, I think he's coming up with an affordable sneaker line or something, which I can respect. Cause I'm sick of seeing people in these in these poverty stricken situations with five hundred dollars shoes on them, three hundred dollars. I'm not trying to be that guy. I'm just saying, you know where I come from, but they ain't never had no five hundred dollars shoes. Yeah, that's a lot. That's a lot of money, bro. The average. Yeah, I'm uh, yeah. surprised you didn't have no three hundred dollars shoes. Now you know my you know my motto sixty nine ninety nine is all <laughs> fine with me. Sixty nine ninety nine. Twenty nine dollars. <laughs> Damn. Thanks, Dame. Thanks, Dame Lillard. I appreciate you, bro. For looking out. Oh, you might be an all the Dame Lillard. All, all the Lillard. <laughs> Damn, big know. bulky. Got the new big bulky Lillard. The big bulky Lillard <laughs> block. She's going to look, look worse than Team Jordan. Like, <laughs> you had some. The Roblox. Yeah, y'all got the Roblox. Got the new Roblox sneakers. <laughs> Yeah, I had Team Jordan. It was no, you got you got the new Mario's. You remember Mario had the big boots, boots. He had him boots, <laughs> big boots. Oh man, bro got the bro got the Mario ninety eight zone. Tell me, it. bro, man, affordable. Uh, man. Yo, show a picture, show an old picture of Mario, man. Yeah, the, oh, uh, you know what I'm talking about, for like Nintendo sixty four or something. But shout oh, out to man. man. All serious. Shout out to Dan, man. Make those affordable sneakers. No, no, no. I, I um, now that I'm older, guys, please, all jokes aside, please get affordable shoes, man. Like, if you got to, I got to get it. Some people, you got to feel worthy, so you got to have a name brand, whatever. Cool. Yeah. This is still a name brand. They're literally making it affordable, so you don't have to go spend 200 300 if he made them same shoes and said it was two fifty, y'all would just run to it. Some people will run to it, not everybody, but some people will run straight to it just because it's two fifty. Yeah. And they, and they, you get what I mean? Yeah. He's I'm... making me like Shaq. Shaq used to make thirty dollars shoes, whatever. Like <laughs> <laughs> Shaq thirty threes, thirty fours. <laughs> y'all got the new thirty four ones, thirty four ones. But if they. Damn, good, they, 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 <laughs> yeah, they oh, yeah, they did. They had this whole logo at all. Oh, my God. But all jokes aside, though, man, like, now that I'm older, like, it's, it's, man, it's good. <laughs> he, ain't buy, he ain't buying them. Stop trying to be nice. He ain't buying them shoes. <laughs> buying them. <laughs> if they're it really, I think right, they're I'll make uh, this vow right now to everyone. This is a YouTube short. I make this vibe to everyone, man. If the new, if the new version, if the new Damian looks affordable sneakers he got coming out, if they actually look good, I don't care. I don't care if they in pay less. I don't care if they discount. I don't care. If they look good, I'm gonna buy them. Cause I'm gonna prove a point here. That's my word. You got it, you heard it here. So. Yeah. Nah, that's it. Yeah. I think they're more, I think they're more <laughs> basketball. Even if Shaq came out with a pair of shoes I actually like, I'd rock him. I'm not playing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he made fun of me for like 20 years with my shoe collection. You're not buying them. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> No, nah, but on the real, I think it's more for basketball. I don't think they're like no casual. If you're a baller, I think it, it has to be tailored to them. Here's a hot take. Even some of the expensive Athlete shoes, ugly. I ain't wearing them. Steph Curry shoes. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, yeah. Ugly. They ain't getting no. Dwayne no. Wade first shoes with Converse. Ugly. Wade and you had them. Jones. I the remember Wade you Jones. had them. Ugly. The uh, Wade uh, counties, man. Who else had some ugly shoes? Then Jason Williams had some shoes. Or something at some point. I think. I don't so. know. There's a but, couple. Couple people had some questionable shoes. Kobe shoes was. Eh, Especially when he made them damn space boots. You remember them space boots? You remember them, the, the white ones with the flaps over it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, yeah. Or nothing. 
Yeah, they got better over time, but they started no, off. That you know. version was ugly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That he, yeah, some people come out with a still, bad. People still bought them though because they was Kobe's. Oh, that's, that proves my point. If you got a name and you make something expensive, people want it. Mm. Yeah, space boots. Yeah, <laughs> space boots, man. Space boots, man. But I know uh, one person that appreciate those Dame Lillard discount shoes is Young Jock after he lost that $1,800 selling the wrong person. Mm. Yeah. Does he, hey, I just got one question. Jock still got that wig? He still perm his hair? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure he got that. Those ingredients. That's tough, though. That's one of my worst fears, though. That's why you got to verify. I don't know what he did, but damn. That per and you got blocked. The person blocked you too. So not only did you lose your money, but you have no communication with the party that you sent the money to. So that's that's terrible. And then once the payment go through, I guess all of them had the same type of uh disclaimer. Once it's cleared and goes through, it's a wrap. Man, you can really do, yeah. So Damn. shout out to Jock. In all seriousness, that sucks, bro. No one wants to lose eighteen hundred. I don't care. Yeah, we are eighteen hundred. It's just a waste. Yeah. I'd rather go spend it on something I want to just yeah, I want that. You know what I mean? Yeah, that, that before that. I before I'm just losing people be like, it's okay, you had it. Nah, yeah. Nah, I rather not, a loss is a loss. It's mm -hmm. not okay. I'm pretty sure people online like, oh, you your job. Is that no, it's not all right. It's not. Yeah, you get it back. No. I don't care what the situation is. It's not okay. Mm -hmm. Let me come take eighteen hundred from you. See how you feel. Hey, did you see that uh viral clip of five year old foreign uh with his uh audio issues? They called it nah. the worst performance ever. At all. He was Dang. performing at in the Brooklyn Arena, the Barclays. Oh, at least it, it sucks. But no, it does suck. And it happened at home. I was gonna say at least it happened at home. No, I'd rather that happen somewhere else. I would rather that happen in no no disrespect, but in Nebraska or Idaho. Yeah. Or like some, like, you can't go back to Brooklyn sounding like that. Damn, Spavio, what happened? Those yeah. audio issues are crazy though. They said he it looked like he forgot his words, but if if it's off beat or if you can't really hear and it's not projecting correctly. Exactly. How you gonna know what you're doing? That sucks. Well, everyone has those. I'm sure it wasn't his first one, but to be on that level in a billion dollar arena, you would think audio issues. Yeah, you, you get the arena and you mess up that there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, so, so that's, that's tough, bro. Shout out to Five. You know, I still rock with Five. He be having, he be having some songs that make you want to bounce. But yeah, man, <laughs> appreciate y'all watching the Real Individuals podcast. RIP. Any last words for him, bro? Watch out for the bull market. I'm not a stock advisor, but I, I, it's coming. I don't know when. Be ready. For sure, for sure. That's what it is. Non-financial advice. Do your research. Until next time, peace. Yo, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace.